You guys haven't played in a long time. Um, I'm sure the, the the game being away from the game action has been nice and a little time to relax for a little bit. But uh, are you guys are worried about you know returning and it's it's conference play and having the layoff? Not at all. Um, just reading here, it says you know we've been off for 18 days. It, you know, for the uh, uh, last game, definitely does not feel like that. Um, but we're not worried at all. Uh, we've had two really good practices in these last few few days, and so just back at it and continuing to work hard. You guys have had some uh, pretty good wins uh, so far on the winning streak right now, and uh, taking on San Diego, a team that uh, has done really well over the years. They took, I believe, both uh, contests last year from you guys, and you guys have built a pretty good yeah. rivalry, and you know, for some for some nice wins that you guys have had. Uh, over the last couple of years, and just talk about kind of the battles you guys have had, uh, especially over your career here. Yeah, uh, San Diego has always been good. Um, always gives us a you know a run for our money. Um, you know, we did beat them two years ago when they were ranked number one. Um, so we can do it. Last year we struggled a little bit, but you know they lost they lost some good players um, this past year, and I can only imagine that they brought in you know some really good freshmen or transfers. Um, they're really good at running their action, uh, very patient, um, great coaching staff that gets them prepared. So um, we're going to be just as ready as you know as they are come Thursday. Yeah, some of your new players have definitely made an impact, but what's going to be the key for you guys to get a win on Thursday? Well, what Coach was saying is we run pretty much the same offense. Um, so we know how to defend it. It's going to be executing and getting good looks and just hitting the open shot. How uh, the win so far, which have been pretty big uh, over some uh, pretty good teams, how is that going to translate? How is that going to help you uh, for your conference schedule? Uh, it'll help us um, a lot. These teams that we played are, you know, they were physical, you know, bigger. Not really going to see that in our conference, but to to play against that and to get used to it, hopefully that'll, you know, we'll, we'll translate that into these uh, our conference games where you know they're a little more athletic. Um, but if we can keep up that, the t you know, the toughness, um, then we should be fine. I'm sure excited, not only for the conference opener, but it's your home opener. It is our home opener, and you know, um, it is against San Diego, a really good team. So, you know, it's a great, great game to open with. Um, just looking at your stats real quick, you know, Jays hit 18 three-pointers in four games. I mean, what's it like as one of her teammates watching her when she starts finding her rhythm out there? Oh my, it's, it's amazing. <laughs> it's amazing. When I'm playing with Jay, you know, I told her, I'm like, I'm going to drive and you just spot up because I'm just going to pass you the ball. She doesn't miss, you know, and so, you know, to have that confidence in a player is just, it's amazing. I love playing with Jay and I'm going to keep giving her the ball. Even if I have a wide open layup, I'm going to find her <laughs> because she, she never misses. <laughs> Um, you know, obviously, you guys are off to a very good start with, you know, like Mae said, a couple big wins. But what do you think has been, you know, something that you guys need to kind of improve upon, kind of maybe polish up heading into conference start? Uh, I think we can improve on our defense. Um, you know, keeping players in front of us, not really relying on help. We know it's there, um, but more, you know, staying, staying in front of who we're guarding um, and guarding their action. I think it's one of the keys we need to focus on.